we define family a couple different ways here. And, and certainly we consider Jean and Susan and the four kids a strong and solid example of, uh, of family at First English. I stay home in order to take care of these four who, who all have their own needs. Mateo has some special needs. Mia will be evaluated uh, this spring. Jacob gets early intervention services. So they all have their own things that they're dealing with. It's, it's a handful trying to keep it going. It's nice that the grandparents are close. My folks are about four blocks away. Her folks are about five blocks away. We went to the uh, same elementary school our kids go to. And they'll go to the same high school we did. I take usually the older kids down the street when I have to uh, shovel or mow at her folks' house. And they'll visit with their grandparents while and Grammy gives them all sorts of junk food while I'm mowing. And, um, and then my dad picks them up from school, usually on Fridays. He drops one of them off and then takes the other one out for a couple hours. I've been going to First English Lutheran since I was three, since we moved to Syracuse. And uh, what was it, about our third or fourth date, she Around wanted to, to get together and, and go to the Westcott Street Fair or something. And I said, well, I can't get together till after church. She said, well, maybe I'll come with you. Susan has served as the congregation council president here. Jean has served in a variety of capacities. The kids are all in the Sunday school. Uh, but I think one of the greatest joys has been uh, for me to be at every single adoption. And when we know that the adoption is set, we have already set the date for the baptism of that child. And we almost, not quite, but almost move from the courthouse to the baptismal font just that quickly. And the congregation has just, um, has just responded lovingly. I think people underestimate what that signature on that document really means in totality. Um, I mean, we've been together so long. We've established our relationship uh, amongst you know, our friends, our family, our church. Um, it would be nice to have it legalized so that we're completely protected.